as you know, this May situation and Fabio Foreign thing has been heating up. Fabio Foreign wanted to troll Mace, so he's remaking one of Mace's old songs. He sampled it, which also is leading people in a lot of confusion. Mace is going to respond as well and give his opinion on it because I guess Mace was insulted when Fabio Foreign told the press and told the media that Mace only gave him $5,000 contract deal. So then Mace trolled Fabio foreign as you all know by now with the famous i'm diddy 2.0 well there's been going a, 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 a lot of back and forth situation between the two and, and mace been really uh, emphatic you know on how he felt about what Fabio foreign said about him he actually was really mad besides the trolling he was kind of low-key hurt by it because he looked out for one of the young ones in the hood according to mace so mace went on a million dollars worth of game podcast and he tells gilly and waddle the real truth you already heard some of the snippets we're gonna play some of those but he basically claps back at Five Year Foreign with the situation. Before we get started, I need y'all to smash that like button. You feel me? Come rock out with the channel. Support, support, support. Make sure you comment, share, and subscribe to the platform. Don't just be somebody who watches only. Get engaged. Get active with this. Let's hit y'all with the intro. So, Fabio Foreign responds as well, but I'll do that on a separate video. Let's go to Million Dollars Worth of Game and Mace and Gilly and Wallow. He'll drive his girls home for an opportunity to learn how to write those kind of songs. Mm. Greatness come from greatness. And people, this whole new mentality that I can do it all by myself. No, Jot. Jordan needed Scotty and he needed Pax. Why would he do this? I still don't I still don't know why. I guess people just want to feel like they did it by themselves, but no great thing is ever done. And I want to give the young niggas a jewel. Greatness come from greatness. If you never achieve greatness, it's going to be because you never was with nobody great. Greatness come from greatness. I had to be a student with big. I rode his blunts. I went to get his weed. I went to drive his girls home for an opportunity to learn how to write those kind of songs. Mm. Greatness come from greatness. And people, this whole new mentality that I could do it all by myself. No, Jot. Jordan needed Scotty and he needed Pax. Why would he? As you can see, man, Mace didn't hold back and how he felt about five year four. And now, my personal opinion is. If we don't look at the paperwork or what's on the contract that was signed or given, it's hard to spectate and go with him versus such. Like, So it's one of them I'm not going to instigate, but I will stand up and say both men are winning out here. Both men has overcome a lot to be where they're at. I'd rather see two brothers go back and forth about topics about contracts versus on the streets banging it out and thugging it out so at the end of the day this is progress and progress is something we promote over here so to see Fabio foreign trolling back and not taking it the violent way even though he can because he's well connected not saying that mace is not you got to respect that in a weird way it's just entertainment at the end of the day, man. Look, y'all, I'm y'all guy, DJ Bless One. If you rocking with the video, you rocking with some of the shorter videos we're doing now for y'all, let me know in the comment sections. If you think Fabio Foreign is in the wrong, let me know how you feel in the comment section so I can get engaged with you. So get engaged in the comment section. Let me know if Pastor, Pastor Mace, Harlem legend, is the one who should have looked out or if he is in the right. So y'all tell me, man. But like, share, and subscribe to Osmo Hip Hop Live. <laughs> Yeah, dropping in and out of floors, done it for my ankle up. 